I didn't fancy see you guys here today, but since you're here, welcome. Today we are doing a chest workout. This is the only chest workout that you will ever need, okay? So if you're ever confused on what to do for chest, save this video and always come back to this video. Also cannot stress how important it is as women to train your chest. I know we're obsessed about big glutes, big thighs, big this, big that, but having a well-structured, strong upper body is key to performing any daily tasks. So do not neglect your chest. So as usual, I have my pre-workout before I start for energy, highly recommend. I'm gonna leave the link for you guys down below. And before I start any upper body workout, I love to warm up using my pull-up band. This is really, really important. I highly recommend that you have one of these. You can get these online. This is from my accessories line. You can also get these from Prozies. I'm gonna leave the link for you guys in my description as well. So we're gonna start with rotations. So I like to go up and over. All right, now if you're not as flexible as I am, you can start from here and stop just about above your head and then repeat. So we're gonna do about 10 reps of this. Bring it in, good. Next we're gonna do pull apart. So you're just gonna hold the band on each side and just pull the band apart. Woo, that felt like the actual workout. Okay, last warm up I like to do, I like to do one arm rotations this time. So I like to go over and just rotate one arm. So now we're gonna go into our first exercise, which is a barbell bench press. Let me drop this, we're gonna get started. So I'm starting with five kg. Very important guys, wear your gloves. You wanna protect your hands as well. I love these gloves from Prozies. I love how it doesn't cover my entire hand, so I do get some air out. I hate when my gloves get all sweaty and stinky after like three days. So these are perfect grips for pull days and push days. So I'm gonna bring the bar a bit lower because right now it's too high. So if you notice on your barbell, you're always going to have two lines here. So I'm gonna grip it right there on those two lines. And then we're gonna push up. And now we're gonna go in for 10 reps. Let's go. Perfect. So I wanted to give you guys a safety tip when you are doing a bench press. Notice how I didn't lock my bar. I didn't use these locks on it. And the reason being is because when you are doing a heavy lift and you find yourself struggling to push the weight back up, it's easier for you to tilt your bar to the side and slide out the weights on either side. So that is a safety tip to keep in mind. Jot that in your notes. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to the next exercise, which is an incline dumbbell bench press. I'm going to adjust my bench for this. You wanna have it about this angle. The weights that I'm going to start off with are five kg dumbbells. Again, you wanna start off with weights that is not too light, but not too heavy so that you can control your reps. And we're gonna to aim to do about 10 reps here. When you're performing this exercise, I want you to not have your elbows out like this, but sort of bring them in to about this position. And then when you press up, you're going to keep a slight bend in your elbows. I'm not locking my elbows out, okay? So you always wanna have a soft touch to it. And then you're going to push down to about here and then press that weight back up 
and then repeat that motion. Remember, we're gonna slowly control our movements because I want you to feel your reps, okay? So let's go. Drop. Good work. Okay, so now we're gonna do dumbbell chest flies. So I'm going to lower this bench a little. I'm gonna have it so about this angle right here. With this movement, first of all, let me drop the weights. You are having, again, slight bend in your elbow and you're bringing the weight out. You're not overextending your arms, okay? Remember I said, do not lock your elbows. So slight bend. I want you to imagine hugging yourself, kind of. So that is the motion and the form that you should maintain. So let me go ahead, grab my weights, lay back on your bench, bring your weights up, and then bring it out. And when you come back in, you're gonna straighten your arms, but when you're lowering them back down, having a slight bend at your elbows. Be careful not to take your arms all the way back. You're out of range of motion here. Okay, so bring it up here. And you wanna stop about this level right here. Okay, so we're gonna do 10 reps of this. Let's go. And also you can do this exercise with the cables. You can also perform this exercise on the machine. There are so many ways to perform a chest fly. So pick whatever one is easier for you, more convenient for you. You can even add some variations to your chest days. If you don't feel like doing dumbbells, you can do chest or you can even do both. All right guys, so the final exercise is a decline barbell close grip press. So remember at the beginning we did a more neutral grip now we're gonna bring our hands in closer. So this is going to target your inner pecs. So about this grip right here is great. And you're going to lift the bar and we're gonna be doing 10 reps of this. All right, and that is all the exercises for today. Now remember, your exercises aren't limited to what I've just shown you. There are so many other really great chest exercises, but these are the mechanics. These are the fundamentals. These are the basics. You can never go wrong with these exercises, and these are sufficient enough to build your chest. Of course, you can, like I said, add different variations in your workout. That's completely up to you, but you don't need a ton of different exercises to grow muscle. You just have to be consistent with a set of exercises and progress over time. So thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down below if this video helps you and I'm gonna see you in my next one. Also guys, all these workouts and more are available on my SoFit app. If you need a training plan to follow, if you need help with your nutrition, you can begin with a seven day free trial. I will leave the links in the description. Also let me know if you guys enjoy these types of videos so that I can make more content like this.